You're listening to The Average Joe Movie Show, where Average Joes review the latest DVDs that have come out as if anyone cared about their opinion. This show is brought to you by the FSA Stock Exchange, where you can buy and sell your favorite movies, actors, athletes, musicians, and more. Visit www.fsastockexchange.com and sign up for a free account. Welcome to the Average Joe Movie Show. Sophisticated people do. I'll be the host for this episode. I'm Brandon. This is Justin. Oh, we forgot to introduce uh, Jeremy. And I'm the guy from Lambert. David Bowie. David Bowie. 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 I can't remember who gives that. I'm Zach. The voodoo that you do. Remember that song? If I could do one of these things. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you remind me of the babe. What's what the story of the babe? The babe with the power. What power? Okay, we've got off track. <laughs> we'll be, for this It'll episode, we'll be reviewing Elf, Ooh. the classic Good Christmas Elf. Uh, do we need a third thing right now? Probably not. Right. Yeah, sure, because you're right. sure. may have not I'm just a little disappointed that you didn't tell me how uh, happy you were that all of us are here. It's good to see you guys out. Uh, Thanks. Very happy to be hosting tonight. We're happy I, you are hosting. you guys have a lot to offer. Mm, we'll see. Mediocre. Okay. Yeah. Mediocre. We'll see. We're kind of tired. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's too much. Too much. So, here we go. Elf is a... It's about... And a kid that's. I can't even Bye, remember that. buddy. <laughs> Good luck he finding your kid. He's adopted by elves in the North Pole, uh, uh, but he's a, a regular old human, and so he's three times the size of everybody Just there. Just doesn't fit. <laughs> or that's awesome. Uh, it's kind of. That's a lot of Will Ferrell, so you have to like him to enjoy the movie, but. Uh, so there he is. He's, the, he's at the North Pole. He realizes that. That's, he's not fitting in, so he's going to go find his dad, his real dad, biological dad, and that's where the story gets very... It's humor and adventure. <laughs> did, did we ever find out why he was in the North Pole? Yeah. I can't remember. Was the very beginning, beginning, he climbed into Santa's bag when Santa came. Oh, Is that what happened? So Santa, Santa took him back to the North Pole, so he was raised by him. That's funny, because I didn't even remember that. Yeah. <clears throat> right. But when you said that now, it yeah. came back. Because apparently Buddy was dumb when he was a baby, too. <laughs> so well, God. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't... Well, you know, you know him, uh, he's not dumb. He just... Innocent. Had a different maybe. type of education. He was dumb. So, I, oh, I was okay. going to say, I, I don't care much for Will Ferrell, typically. But this one, I, I really like Elf. Like, yeah. It is a Will Ferrell that I can stand and enjoy, actually. Yeah. And it's completely clean, isn't it? Yeah, for the most part, yeah. Yeah, no real cursing or anything. Yeah, or innuendo or stuff, sure. Yeah. I thought this was one of Will Ferrell's best. Yeah, I agree. He just fit the role because he was supposed to be a dummy. Yeah, yeah. he was supposed to be a dummy, and so he played Will Ferrell well. (laughs) Yeah. He was was supposed to be kind of annoying. Yeah. And 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 he fit the mold. And still a little bit lovable. You you kind of feel bad for him, but you still want him to. Succeed in whatever he is yeah. doing. Now, the girl in it, is she a singer? Zoe. Is she, no, is she I did read somewhere that she has a band. Because she sings in all of her movies. Yes, yes. Yeah. and her new TV show. She's she got a TV, TV show? show? The new girl, I haven't really seen it. Oh, either, well, that's right. She sings the opening, and I think once in a while, the end of the show. Yeah. And yeah, she does sing in all of them. Yeah, and well, she always well, she 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 plays out. like a quirky, just slightly off, like still cool, but. Was she the one in the. The Hundred Days of Summer or whatever, or yeah, was she was that yeah. the same girl? Zoe Deschanel. Oh, that's what she, 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 she sang the national anthem for Sunday Night Football a little while back. Did she get it right? Yes, that's, that's like fifty like percent. It's like a she first did a good job, time. actually. She sounded pretty good. Yeah. She's she's a I like actress. I like her. Actors. I like her, her yeah, yeah. Movies. yeah. She does a great job with that. that Maybe it's cold outside. That mm-hmm. the song is. Yes. Is that not, the one where he kind of like sneaks in on yeah. her? He starts singing with her and stuff. Yeah. yeah. That's a funny scene. Yeah. That's that's probably your uh, your most uh, risque. Risque. Yeah, that, that's a good term. Yeah. Or it's, she's in the show. Yeah. I'll, I'll so tell you, my, my favorite part of that show <laughs> is, and my kids' favorite part too, 
is where he's like drinking the coke. Like they're all sitting around the dinner table, and he's the the mom, or I guess yeah, I guess it's his mom or his stepmom or something. It's like you really like sugar, don't you? And he's like, is there sugar in syrup? <laughs> <laughs> then yes, I do. And he's drinking all this coke, and then he just lets out this like two minute burp. So like, and then the end of the burp. Did you hear that? He says to the kid, like, kids, like, of course I heard that. <laughs> my kids crack up on that every time. We, in fact, my wife made me record like that little snippet of it on our DVD. Oh, yeah, just so the kids could watch that funny part. But anyway, <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, I could have done with less tights. <laughs> there was a lot of tights. It's, yeah. it's a little funny. A lot of will tights. See the, uh, <laughs> the, the jar, jar too. He's that small. Yeah, no, he's, he's like, I did. Six three. <laughs> When he gets hit by the car, too, and it just takes his legs out from under. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's some great scenes in it. There are some yeah, excellent scenes. Why is he even spaghetti with the syrup, too? Oh, it just oh, it's it's so gross, <laughs> but he just... Do you like sugar? <laughs> is there sugar in the syrup? <laughs> yeah, it's funny. Pulls it out. <laughs> <and> it's <laughs> it's <gully. so laughs> Wait, wait. I, th- I, oh, I do have some. Yeah, it's... There are a <laughs> lot of funny stuff, and the funny thing is, it's one of those kind of, like, Napoleon Dynamite... The first time I watched it, I'm like, eh, that's kind of funny. But the more you watch it, you catch other little really? funny things yeah. and one-liners and stuff. And it's like, eh, it's pretty good. It's turned into kind of a classic. I yeah. love when he's messing with the, the the guy that's the writer that happens to be a little oh, person. Little person. <laughs> oh, you're the nose! Did you call me a Santa? Does Santa know that you left the North Pole? <laughs> he's oh, a he's an angry elf. <laughs> if you call me up one more time, he runs across the table. <laughs> yeah, that. See, there's tons of good scenes. The more you think about it, so the more you can find good scenes in it. Everybody needs to see that. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Yeah. And, and it, the, another thing I like about it is there are a lot of good Christmas movies that at least you know, I like a lot of them, but that one's funnier than most yeah. of them. Yeah. I love how they make him totally unnatural in the real world, but anything having to do with winter, he just excels at. Like, yeah, the, snow the snowball fight. Yeah. Like, it's like rapid fire snowball fight. Yeah. yeah that is a class. Very realistic. Totally. Oh, I mean, yes. it's an elf look. And it's become one of those <laughs> movies that you need to watch every Christmas. I mean, like, there's what, the Christmas story. That's it's exactly, it's yeah. kind of the Christmas yeah. story of, of our that generation. Yeah. 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 So, it's good times. It's good. It's reminding me again. I'd probably watch it again. Yeah. It's going to be on. And it's on TV. TNT. Like, yeah, right? It was on like sci-fi or something, I think, one time, too. <laughs> sci-fi? <laughs> yeah. I think they're just trying to... Because he's kind of cyborg when he has this behind-the-scenes yeah. stuff. <laughs> no factories. It's on Discovery Channel. <laughs> There's a, you know that <laughs> part when he's leaving? When he's leaving the North Pole and the little Morwell comes up? And he's like, Bye, buddy. Yeah. Hope you find your dad. <laughs> I use that line all the time. Like when I'm leaving something, awesome. I'll just be like, "Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad." <laughs> great, it's a great line. <laughs> awesome. Uh, I, one last thought about it. I did read that James Conn um, hated Will Ferrell by the end of the film. Oh really? I see James Conn hating everybody. Yeah, yeah. He seems like he just seems like, he just seems like that personality. Like, yeah, like that's really. I know bitter. Like, kind of me. Yeah. Yeah. We still love you, and if you want to watch, please do. Oh, yeah. More importantly, if you want to send us money. <laughs> Sponsor please. us. And if you don't... I will hate Will Ferrell, too, for money. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll hate him for free, yeah, actually. Because well, I pretty much do accept everything L. but L. <laughs> now, what about Bewitched? Not to carry this on long. I haven't. Really. Never saw it, but I can only imagine it's his typical dumb self. I liked it. I liked Bewitched. There was one that I liked him funny. where he was more normal. It's the one where he was oh, here. Right, right. Where he's yeah. the guy. Um, Here's the voice. Stranger than fiction. fiction. Yeah, fiction. That was a good one. When he's when he's not he's being well. Yeah, he's it's, really it's, it's fun. It's good. Sure it's a good job. Yeah. Well, I guess that's a that's a pretty much unanimous vote for Elf, then, right? Yeah, yeah absolutely. Okay. See it. Everybody should see it. Check it out. Right, one you might even want to own. Yeah, I, I don't. Okay.